All right, I'm on hole number two of the Pacific Cup Tournament. I'm in the opening round of the Ricky Division. Let's go to hole number two. Let's go to Golf Class Notebook and check it out. So we're on Kohong Resort, hole number nine. Hole number nine. Da -da -da -da. Did not mean to hit ball guide. Hole number nine. All right. I need to get right up into this area right here. And you don't have to do a lot. Somewhere out in that circle, just to the shadow or right in front of the shadow is fine. You don't have to press the issue here. Bring an accurate club. Bring your QB. I've got, in my low-level account, I've got a QB7. It's only got like three topspin. It gets me right about where this dot is right here. And it's not... Uh, I'd like a little bit more distance. It gets me out into this area, but anywhere up here is fine. You don't have to press the issue here. This whole center area of the fairway right here, you don't have to get out here. You don't have to get any distance. You don't have to do any overpower. I'm going to bring a QB. The raw distance doesn't do you any good here because you can't, you can't get over to that spot without doing overpower, so it's QB straight up sniper kingmaker cut the wind down. That's all I need. Going for the Albi. <laughs> Sorry about that. Oh, here we go. So we can get that albatross on this hole. So the first shot. It's so a one shot at a time. Now I'm seeing some people go to the left. And in one-on-one -on -one play, I go to the left. But there's no chance for Albatross over there at all. And it is a very tricky shot to go to the left. But for the way I play my game, it's almost a guaranteed eagle. Whereas if you come over here and you mess this drive shot up and you end up in the rough or the sand over in this area, you're sunk. You can't, your eagle shot's gone. In tournament play, we want to play to the right because it opens up the door for an Albi. But you got to be real careful on this drive. Real careful. That was close. And that's, you don't need much, you don't need any more distance than that. It's nice to get up to the shadow, but... Right there will work fine. All my top spin. I'm going to do about a 10% adjustment on the drive. The wind's blowing that way, so it's a 2.5, say 2.7, 2.75, somewhere in that neighborhood. A little bit of curl just to bring it back to the fairway. Hitting a one ring great to the right. Just floating up to the shadow. All right. That's step number one. Step number two. Straight at it. I'm going to start off on the left-hand edge of the cup. And the ball guide's lying just a titch. <laughs> See if my opponent can get it right. They did not adjust the wind out. They did move it over to the left a little bit, but... Isn't it perfect? Let's see if they can get it in. Off trajectory just a bit. All right, here we go.
10 edge of the cup, 3-5. Definitely at max club, so that's 3-5. Just trying to hit it perfect. Hitting it one ring great to the right. That's my story for today. One ring great to the right. How did you hit today? I hit one ring great to the right. One ring great to the right. No, no, it was one ring great to the right. <laughs> That's not right. No, it was. It was one ring great to the right. Somewhere in there, there's a perfect, I'm sure. I give him a little rhythm. I need to go into the weekend with really good tiebreaker, so. Gonna have to pick it up here and quit dinking around. Quit hitting one ring great to the right. Woke up this morning a little congested. A little runny nose. I will forfeit. Spread the wealth. I'm like Robin Hood. Giving back to the little people. All right. The spam calls have started already today. <laughs> All right, that was hole number two of the opening round in the Pacific Cup Tournament. Thanks for watching.